So somebody asked why people act differently with affair partners, why women are more adventurous with affair partners. Well, everybody acts different with their affair partners. If they could act that way that they're acting, whether it's romantic and, and sexually adventurous, whatever, in their main relationship, then they would be doing that. The entire point of the affair is excitement, newness, um, doing something different. Men act so much more romantic with their affair partners that that's often the most difficult part of it for their wives is the guy was sending flowers and writing poems and emailing her a million times a day and saying all these compliments that she sees in the text messages and it's a way that he never acted with her just as guys are heard if they figure out that she did more sexual stuff with the affair partner. But think about it. People who cheat, right, they already are, um, they're wanting something new. They want to feel alive. That's the number one reason for cheating. Most people who cheat statistically identify as happily married, you know, and they're not doing it to hurt their partner. They're doing it because they want to feel young and alive. They never expected that they would cheat, and now they are. And you could you could read a lot of different books on this, you know. Um, State of Affairs by Esther Perel would be a good one. And I do continue to get on recovering from infidelity myself. But the, the point is, of course, people are going to do something new and different with the affair partner. That's the entire point. They're feeling bored. They're feeling stuck. And only with this new person can they explore other aspects of themselves, right? So this is a different, completely different situation than this fake thing where women will uh, only be adventurous in bed with men they don't want to marry. No. Most women want to do everything in bed that they like with every subsequent boyfriend, except they're winnowing down what they like because they're getting more experience. So they may have tried a lot of stuff when they were early, just starting out having sex, that they don't want to do anymore. You know, but everything that they like, they want to do with whoever they're with at that point. And if that's their husband, then he gets to do whatever it is that she likes to do by that point, which is often quite a bit, you know, that she's learned to like and some things that she hasn't. But this whole affair partner thing, yes, of course, people act different when they have affairs. Obviously, they have decided that there's a part of themselves that needs exploring. And that's what they are doing. Definitionally, this would be the main time that anybody would try a new way of being, whether that's romantic, sexual, vulnerable, emotional, anything.